Welcome to Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Leslie Weidenbenner, and I'm here today with Representative Kevin Mahan. He's a Republican from Hartford City. Welcome. Thanks, Leslie. Good to be here. You have been very involved in efforts to work on the Department of Child Services and some of the problems that that agency has been having. Can you talk about those problems first and then tell us a little bit about what you think the solutions are? Sure. Well, I was asked by Speaker Bosma to sit on that summer study committee uh, this past summer and then uh, later became the co-chairman of that committee with Senator Holdman. And you know, when you look back to last session and you've seen how that uh, became quite contentious, um, you know, with uh, folks from the other side of the aisle, um, it was something I was really concerned about. But Leslie, I can tell you that uh, with all the meetings that we had, the bipartisanship that was there, the fact that everyone that came to the table put kids and their safety first, it was very refreshing to see how I think things are supposed to work here in, uh, in Indianapolis. So we uh, put some good uh, suggestions together, put that into bill format, and we carried that forward uh, so far successfully here in this legislative session. Do you think that DCS has made some changes that are helpful even before any legislation has passed? Well, I certainly do think uh, you know there's been a paradigm shift there. Uh, the big issue that uh, I was hearing dealt with local control. And uh, it's something I've said uh, from the very beginning, at the end of the day, uh, the, the message was local control. Uh, the call center has its place. It's something I still endorse. Uh, but what we're going to be able to do from that standpoint is we're going to be putting a lot of the decision making back in the 92 counties where you have uh, the DCS workers there that work hand in hand with law enforcement, judges and prosecutors that know a lot of these actors and they can make decisions on whether they're going to advance an investigation or not. Do you think legislation is still needed even though DCS has made some changes? Well, I certainly uh, think we do with a lot of the play that's uh, uh, been put on this, uh, even some of the spin that's there. And I think that uh, handling a lot of this legislatively um, is, is the proper action that we need to take. What would the commission, the new commission on children do that you have in legislation? You know, interesting thing, Leslie, we had discovered that there's over 30 different boards or commissions that somehow deal with the safety of children. That's a lot of commissions. Well, it really is. And, and the ironic thing is a lot of these commissions and boards, they don't even realize the other ones exist, let alone talk to one another. So this will be the granddaddy of, of them all, if you will. And it's going to bring all the key players uh, in the state of Indiana together to sit on a commission. And one of the things that we eliminated in the uh, in the House bill was the designee, you know, because it originally it had the director of DCS or his or her designee, and we've eliminated those designee. Hope it stays that way in the second half. So we're going to have the key players at the table when we're talking about the safety of the children. The House has already passed a budget. What did you like about the budget that you all came up with? Well, I certainly liked, uh, in reference to the DCS, is the fact that there's going to be uh, several million dollars more added to, specifically, uh, the budget uh, dealing with DCS. Where we're going to ramp up some additional folks uh, for the call center uh, to help with the turnover uh, that's happening. Their turnover rate has been in excess of 50 percent. Uh, we feel that that's going to uh, really alleviate that uh, quite a bit. And we're going to get some additional help out in the field uh, for these DCS workers that's working in the trenches. and many times working with some of the worst of the worst cases here in the state of Indiana. And do, and do you feel like that that, that that extra funding for DCS is likely to pass? Yeah, you know, I was very, very satisfied with uh, the way Chairman Brown uh, tackled this and his committee. They were very dedicated to it. And it's my understanding, uh, uh, Senator Kinley, uh, likewise, is uh, just as impressed uh, with all the work that got put into this, and uh, we're hoping it stays. Thank you so much, Representative Mayhem. I'm Leslie Weidenbitter with Comcast Newsmakers.